in the middle of summer, there's something about getting up early in the morning, launching your boat, and going out onto the Great Lakes in search of salmon and trout. Great Lakes anglers know that you have to pick the right day to go out on the water. Can't be too rough, because in some cases you're fishing one to 10 miles offshore, depending where the fish are. Both salmon, steelhead, and lake trout feed on bait fish that are anywhere from three to about five inches long. Some of these bait fish can be suspended close to the surface. At certain times of the year, they'll be down in about 100 feet of water. So the only way that you can find out where they are is using a fish finder, but when you find them, you usually find the trout and the salmon. While most anglers use a variety of lures to catch those salmon in the Great Lakes, I find that trolling with a large streamer fly works extremely well when it's fished in conjunction with a flasher that actually attracts salmon from quite a distance. The lure Jensen flash fly comes in different colors and the color that you choose is very important. For example, early and late in the day, it's very important to use some of the darker colors. I find that during the middle of the day, some of the more clear colors work extremely well. To find these fish in deeper water, the flasher and fly combination work really well because once they see the flasher, they focus on the fly that's behind it, which looks like a darting bait fish, and they usually grab it. Very important when you do get a strike on it that you pick up the rod right away and that you start reeling to pick up any slack line because sometimes both salmon and trout will head towards the boat after they strike. And if you have other lines in the water, it can create problems. The distance that you rig your fly to your flasher can be very important. If the fish are very aggressive, normally a short distance is good. But if the fishing is tough, you might have to go with about a 10 to 15 foot lead away from the flasher. If you love Great Lakes trolling for salmon, steelhead, and lake trout, trolling a fly behind a flasher can really increase your success rate.